Welcome again students, this is the last video in our section. Now it's time to test our robot to find whether it's working or not, to find whether our project is successful or not. Okay, so let's start. As you can see, this is the robot and the robot is still connected to the laptop. Okay, so this is before uh, connecting it to a se separate power source. Okay, so it's powered by the laptop, my personal laptop here. And as you can see, this is in my hands. This is the joystick button that's going to control the arm. And the arm here is this a green uh, hook, as you can see. And I'm going to try to catch as mu much possible as uh, fish as I can. Okay, so let's start. As you can see here. Okay. So this is the bottom. I will try it first. I will turn on the toy. And as you can see, it's moving right and left. So no problem with the x-axis right and left it's moving correctly now up and down also as you can see the hook is moving up and down normally so here as you can see I am trying to catch some fishes but I cannot do that okay can you do that try it and you can now one idea of this robot for example you can let's say design a, a game or a challenge between you and your friends and everyone can make a separate robot and you can put a common uh, pool a common pool of fish between you and you can challenge yourselves and see who can catch a higher number of fish in a shorter time it will be a good idea for a robotic competition or for example you can uh, let's say you can make a stand in a science fair and you can design a robot and then you can uh, also like uh, put the robot and put the chair and challenge people to come and try to test their skills in catching the fish so this is all about the ideas that can be derived from this robot.